What is good guys, Repkicks here, and we're back at it again with another review for you. This one I'm super excited about. I love this pair. This is the Jordan 1 Yellow Toe. This is from another great seller that I've been getting a lot from. I actually have three more pairs from him, and I have to say, every single pair from him is phenomenal. He's up there, I think, on and boom status. He's going to become one of the best sellers, I think, on my channel, and I'm going to do a lot more from him because he's really amazing. He has great dunk deals and great deals all the time, and his product is just up there in par with Ann's. His service is amazing. His prices are really good. You guys got to check him out. This is from Danny Chen. You could check him out. Danny Kicks. Here's his Instagram. Make sure you give him a follow. And he is amazing. So check him out. Make sure you mention discount code REPKICKS for a discount. And let's get into it. These yellow toes caught my eye since I first saw the pictures of them. I waited a little while. And as soon as I saw these on Danny's Instagram and how good they were, I just had to cop right away. The materials are so nice. It has this beautiful beautiful black toe. Any black toe Jordan one I love, you guys know that. Look at that beautiful slim toe box. The toe box is just amazing. The materials are always nice on these black toes. You have this beautiful white pebbled leather and it's super soft and nice. And then you have that nice pebbled yellow leather there. Looks really, really good. The correct yellow. The midsole paint line is perfect. You can see the midsole even looks good. All the details, the stitching is tight. None of the yellow going into the white there. I mean, this is just a beautiful, beautiful shoe. He provides a lot of batches. He has LJR, M batch, a bunch of different batches, so you're not just getting one from him or not knowing what you're getting. I don't know if these are LJR. They probably are because how good they are. But even if it's not whatever batch it is, I don't care because they are perfect. So like I said, you have that beautiful black material that goes around the toe here. That toe box is perfect. Look how nice and slim it is. Has that nice curve here. And then you have the nice black material that's around this panel and the lace hole panel there. Nice clean stitching. The stitching on this whole pair is really, really good. Corner stitch looks fine to me. You have that nice black swoosh. Positioning is perfect. It's not hooked. Clean stitching on it. Stays close to the edges and is perfect. Then you come back to these yellow panels. The yellow looks really good. It's nice and pebbled, especially on the top there. You can see the leather cuts are good and the stitching on all those panels. Even the white double stitch on the white pebble leather there looks real good. And around the top here, you have that nice yellow stitch. Wings placement looks good, and the logos look really, really nice. The R&D do touch. Has a nice gloss to it. You don't want it to be matte. And then you have that nice soft black leather around here. This yellow leather is just super, super soft and beautiful too. That's the outside, and we'll come and look at the outside of this one same thing everything's exactly the same it's just perfect there's no flaws pretty much whatsoever on this this is a really super solid pair toe box looks good it's real nice and slim the stitching looks good on it the leather cuts are good you can see the nice detail in the midsole those stars that yellow line is absolutely perfect and straight no yellow paint going into the white there stitching's real nice and tight that white stitching on the white part of the midsole got the beautiful black leather around on the toe this panel here you can see the stitching is nice and clean on all those black panels the lace holes are punched through nice and a nice clean stitching on all those black panels then we come to the nice white pebble tumbled leather which is super soft and high quality not synthetic it's just real real nice on there beautiful swoosh the stitching on that swoosh is probably the best one that i've seen in a while remember how sometimes it kind of shies away when it goes around this curve that one's perfect corner stitch is perfect you got that nice pebbled leather on the yellow here that yellow color looks really really good wings placement looks good here in the Wings logo looks real nice. You get a nice up close look at that. Then you have the yellow stitching around these yellow panels here. Nice pebbling on this yellow here. And the double stitch on the white panel looks real good. So this side looks perfect. I really don't see much wrong at all. Come to the medial side, everything's pretty much the same thing without the Wings logo. I'll just give you a close look at that. Beautiful yellow panels. The coloring's correct. The yellow stitching. Look at this yellow panel. The swoosh looks good. Nice white tumbled pebble, white leather there, the double stitch. All those black panels look good. Really nice high quality leather. The toe box is real slim. Beautiful paint line. I don't see any flaws on these at all. So if you want a great pair of these and other ones, Danny Chan, man, he's your guy to go to. One more look at the medial side of this one. Start with the yellow panels there. Look how nice that is. 
beautiful soft material and then you have that nice beautiful this is the softest up here around the ankle this black material there nice double stitch on that white pebbled leather then a nice pebble leather around the heel beautiful yellow stitching swoosh looks good it's nice and centered it's not hooked you get a nice close-up of the stitching on there no corner stitch flaw the double stitch on there looks fine all those black panels look perfect you can see the lace holes look good the stitching looks good no choppy leather toe box shape is perfect it has that nice curve to it see that there and it's not too boxy that's exactly what a retail would be that curve right in the front there slim toe box Perfect midsole paint line looking real good. No flaws at all, man. This is a real great pair. Thank you, Danny, for providing this. So if we come to the back, now the hourglass maybe could be a little bit better. You can see the leather cuts around the yellow there look real nice with that nice gold stitching around it. The black leather looks good. Heel tabs are nice and center and even with each other. The double stitch that goes on that white leather is nice and clean. The swoosh is coming even. And the beautiful leather cut and stitching that goes around the back here that starts on the bottom. You can see that looks good. Midsole looks good there. Heel cuts are fine. Midsole paint line looks perfect. Come around to the front. Perfect toe box. When I show you the yellow material on the toe box, you're going to love it. Nice, clean, and even toe strap on there. The black toe there. You can see the nice yellow stars on there. Beautiful paint line. It stays nice and clean all the way around the whole shoe. Then the white midsole with the nice, tight white stitching. Now we'll come up to the top of the toe. Look at that nice pebbled yellow leather on there look how beautiful that is nice and soft the shape of the toe box is just perfect the cutouts are real nice the leather cuts are clean the double stitch stays consistent all the way around the toe i just love that pebble look on this yellow i think without the pebble look on the yellow and the white and if it didn't have the pebbling on here it just wouldn't look as good i think that makes it and makes it look a lot better the holes look good there's no toe box hole flaw at all all those holes are punched through nice you get a nice close-up of that so everything looks good and it's just an all black jordan one tongue so nothing special just a regular jordan one tongue the same material that's on all of them same thing on this one regular jordan one tongue all black then we come up to the tag there they both look good got the nice nike air on there the swoosh looks nice it's an all white tongue with the same yellow that's on the rest of the shoe i think the text looks good the font and everything looks nice and clean no noticeable flaws or call outs from that Come around to the sock liner. It's just an all black Jordan 1 sock liner. Real nice shape to it. And you can see the padding and everything. It's just like a retail Jordan 1. And then you come to the insole. And it's just an all yellow insole. The same color yellow that's on the side here. With the black Nike Air there. So that's good. That's the only logo that's on there. And then you can come around and look at the tag. For you people who like the tag. So that's the inside of that one. That is the right shoe. Same thing on the left one, all black sock liner, beautiful material there, has some nice cushioning, the exact amount that a retail pair would have, you could see the shape of that heel and everything looks good, all yellow insole with the black Nike Air there, I love the yellow insole, I think if they would have put a black one or a white one it wouldn't look as good, so that's the insole with the Nike Air and everything looks good on that, back of the tongue, regular Jordan 1 back of the tongue material and then the same trademark and all that that's on all of them the font and everything looks fine on there same thing on that one so everything looks good and then it also comes with an extra set of yellow laces we're definitely going to put these yellow laces in I don't like putting black laces with a black tongue and uh, I think putting the yellow in will really really make this thing pop bring out the other parts of the yellow and uh, just look a lot better than the black laces so we're definitely going to throw them in regular yellow flat laces so nothing special about that the box is just an all yellow box like a regular Jordan 1 box but it has the black Nike on it and then you come up to the tag there there's the tag it does have the suggested retail price of 170 on that so there's that so there you have it guys a phenomenal pair of jordan one yellow toast from danny chang i'm telling you you guys have to watch danny's page follow him he is amazing he's getting up there as one of the great sellers in my opinion up there with ann and boom i got a couple pairs from him so far and every single one was so high quality like this he only provides the best just like ann i really have to say he's probably up there on ann's level so i really really recommend him i got some ama Meniers from him some off-white jordan fives to review from him travis 
LJRs from him. I reviewed some Panda Dunks, and they were all amazing. He does some great, great deals on Dunks. $99 shipped on a lot of them sometimes, so you got to check him out. Here's his Instagram. You could give him a follow. Make sure you follow his page. He posts a lot of great in-hand pictures, not just sharing photos with all sellers and stealing them. Those are his own in-hand picks, which is really cool. I mentioned discount code REPKICKS. It'll give you a discount. Appreciate you guys, and stay tuned for more. Peace.